We wanted to become house parents at Boys Ranch because the things that we were doing um, made us realize that there are a lot of kids who are really struggling and they needed a lot more help than you can give in the school system or in a few hours of daycare time and being able to be with them full time meant that we could invest more time and energy into helping them become who God created them to be. I had a nephew that was working for Cal Farley's and he knew of our struggles in the school system and uh, he just said you should come visit me and that's all it took. It's not really, I mean, a job, it's our life. Yeah. I mean, we live our life with all of these, you know, youngsters in it and, you know, every year we get more and more kids in and it's just, I mean, they grow, we grow. I mean, it's just them. It's the kids that keep us here. And we just grew in the love of God and we knew that we had to share that and we felt that there was a calling on our life. We didn't know for sure yet what that was, but we knew that we needed to share what we had learned with those in need. Growing up, I had a lot of coaches and teachers through the years that have impacted my life. And I think for me is a way to pay it back to them or show them that, you know, I'm grateful for what they've given me. And we've, you know, decided to try to give that same, maybe inspiration to other kids working with these girls who have very like traumatic backgrounds. It's been very important to kind of hang back and let them come to me and interact with me rather than like forcing a relationship. And because of that and being kind of that safe adult uh, male that they probably don't have in their lives, been able to make some new connections that I wouldn't be able to otherwise. Being an educator, you're very conscious about building relationships with your kids so that they can grow and learn and feel safe in your classroom. Um, and that carries over here because it's the same thing. Um, I know personally, I used to think on Fridays, I hope so-and-so comes back on Monday because I knew what they were going home to on Saturday and Sunday. And I always would tell them, I wish I could bring them all home so that I know that they'll be back on Friday. Um, now I get to kind of fulfill that other end of the cycle in that I am home 